you must have children in order to be a father. And every child has a biological father, grandfathers, and some of us even have stepfathers and godfathers. So, is it safe to say we all understand what a father is? Maybe not, because how we perceive our earthly fathers has greatly impacted the way we perceive and understand the role of our heavenly father. In Hebrew, the term translated father is av, which means chief, patrimony, or principal, as in the first in importance. Av is made up of only two letters, Aleph and Bet. Aleph is the picture of an ox, meaning strong leader or first. And Bet is the picture of a tent, meaning house. These two pictographs show that a father, an Av, is the strength or leader of the house. Likewise, a father, Av, pitieth his children. So the Lord pitieth them that fear him. Psalm 103, 13. There are numerous direct comparisons between our earthly fathers and our heavenly father in the Bible. When we study the scriptures, we can easily see how we should regard our earthly fathers in comparison to our heavenly father. They are both the strength and the leaders of their houses. Our heavenly father has set a high standard for the role of a father because he has never failed. For this reason alone, we can cry, Abba, Father. If you are a Christian, you are probably more familiar with the term Abba than you are with the term Av. In Gethsemane, our Lord Jesus Christ used the Aramaic term Abba. Although Abba does not appear in the Hebrew Old Testament, it is transliterated three times in the Greek New Testament. Abba is a left bet and an added aleph at the end. This emphasizes the Father's power and highlights His sufficiency. Ava's biblical use case is always from the child's point of view towards the Father, because to cry, Ava, is the Father's child saying to Him, Father, I acknowledge who You are and Your sufficiency. Because of this, I will obey. Happy Father's Day. If you learned anything from this Hebrew word study, Please like, share, and consider subscribing. And there's more to discover. Check out my books, Elucidations and God's Garden, as well as my other publications by clicking the link in the description.